Welcome to this lesson and thank you for joining us. We are going through from four mathematics and uh, three dimensional geometry. And the question we have reads, the figure below shows a cuboid A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H in which AB is 8 centimeters, AB is 8 centimeters, BC is 6 centimeters, and uh, CF is 4 centimeters. The first question we are supposed to calculate or to work out is calculate the length of AC. And uh, we have the length AC here. If we can draw a broken line from A to C, you realize A, B, and B, C meet at 90 degrees. And therefore now we can extract this triangle here. We can extract this triangle where this is 90. This is uh, 6 and this is 8. And therefore we need A, C which is the hypotenuse. So to get AC, we know hypotenuse squared will always be equal to the base squared, which is 8 squared, plus the height squared. So H squared will be equal to 8 squared, which is 64, plus 6 squared, which is 36. And this gives us 100. And therefore now to get H, we take the square root of 100 which is 10 centimeters so the length AC is 10 centimeters we move down to part B remember to subscribe to the channel and also share the link with friends the angle between the line AF we have AF and AC so we can now draw a broken line towards AF So we need the angle between AF and uh, AC. Let us sketch this triangle like this. So this is A, this is F, and this is C. The angle between AF and AC is this angle. We can call it angle theta. Remember we have AC as 10 centimeters. We have uh, A, we have CF as 4 centimeters. The angle we need is the angle theta. And uh, we are given the opposite and the adjacent sides of this angle. And therefore, we can use tan. Tan theta is given by the opposite, which is 4, over the adjacent, which is 10. So... To get theta, we are going to get the tan inverse, the tan inverse of 0 0.4, and this one is going to give us, so if you use your calculator, the tan inverse of 0 0.4 would give us 21.80 degrees, and that becomes the answer to that particular question. Next, we have a uh, the angle the AG makes with the plane ABCD, we have uh, AG, it makes with the, the plane ABCD, so we need to look at the line of intersection between uh, AG and the plane, so we can uh, extract this triangle. We can extract this triangle like this, such that we have A. We have B and we have G. So we have uh, the angle AG mixed with the plane ABCD. The line of intersection becomes AB. So again, we need this angle theta here. We know BG is 4 centimeters and AB is 8 centimeters. So again, we have the opposite and the adjacent. We can use tan theta. And tan theta is given by opposite over adjacent. So to get 
theta we simply take the tan inverse of uh, 4 out of 8 which is 0 0.5 and if you press the tan inverse of 0 0.5 you get 26.57 degrees and that is uh, the answer to part C of the question. The next now we have the angle between the plane. The angle between the plane C. We have C D H G. So we have C C D H G. So this is what we have. This is the plane we have and A B C D and A B C D so we need to look at the line of uh, intersection between the two planes and in this case if we can extract that if we can extract that we are going to have we are going to have uh, this triangle like this We are going to have this triangle like this so we have uh, this line AD is the same as FC and uh, therefore AD is the same as BC so if we extract that triangle we are going to have 4 6 and the angle we need is this angle theta here so if you want to calculate the size of this angle that is the angle between the plane C, D, H, G and A, B, C, D. We again use the tan. Since we are given the opposite of the angle and the adjacent. So the tan theta is going to be equal to opposite of adjacent. And therefore now to get theta, we are going to get the tan inverse of uh, 4 out of 6. And if you find the tan inverse of uh, this value here, it is going to give us 33. It's going to give us 33.69 degrees, correct to two decimal places. And uh, that becomes the answer to that particular question.